In this video, we will see how the issued book can be returned in Fedina. So here we will visit academics and library module and let's see the books that are already borrowed by the students. To check that list, we can go to the option of manage books and here we can filter by borrowed and we will see the list of books that are borrowed. Now let me Let's assume that there is a student who comes up with this book C2 and wants to return it. As a librarian and an administrator, I can see this option of return book and I can again enter the book number if I'm aware of it and the student is telling the same. Otherwise, I can use the barcode option as well. To use the barcode option, you have to click on this cell and hover over the barcode of the book. And the number of that barcode will be read and it will be shown here. Then click on search and the details of that book will show up. For now, I am entering the number of the book and it shows these details about the book. I can click on the title to see further information. You can see it shows the further details like the book holder, which is a student, the book issue date, and the due date which was yesterday. So here we can see that the due date of this book has been exceeded. If a due date of the book is exceeded, the librarian or the administrator can enter fine amount. So here we can enter that information. For example, let's say it is this amount and click on return. So here the book has been returned. We can check in manage books, the status of this book now, it was C2 and we can see it is made available and can be issued to any other student or employee. Also the fine amount that has been collected through the library module, it can be multiple fine amounts that are collected. We can check the information about that by going to this option of library fines within a particular duration. We can select that duration from here. We'll be able to check out all the fine amounts that are collected. Here we can also revert them if we do not, if we have collected them by mistake or an amount is collected wrongly, it can be reverted and the same can be collected again. Another option where this gets affected is the finance module when you go inside the finance reports. You will see this transaction report and you can check it out for a particular duration again. You will see that under the library fees option in the finance categories, since it is an income to the institution, it shows up that amount. This amount will keep on adding based on the number of fines and amount of fines that you collect from the students if they are not returning the book on time. So this is how the book can be returned. For a regular book return, you can again fill in the number of the book like this. Click on the title of the book and here it is not showing you an option of collecting fine since the due date is yet to come. You can just collect this book back from the student and it will become available in the library. So this is how you will be able to manage the returns that you get for the books in Fedina. In the next video, we will see some reports that are related to the library module.